We're getting into the World Cup spirit this week and we're making South Africa's traditional dessert called a milk tart, which is basically like the traditional British custard tart. Now, any South Africans watching this will say that I've taken out way too many of the stages and that it's no longer authentic, but I've had to really simplify it because otherwise it would be too long to cook with Archie in the kitchen. I've never cooked these before. I've got no idea how they're gonna turn out. Here you go, push it down really, really hard. <sighs> really hard, is it out? Bit more, I think. Hold on. There we go. Well, I wouldn't eat it probably until it's cooked. Here we go. In the pot it goes. I it. We can try it, but I'm sure it's not that great. A bit sugary. Okay, another one. Push down really hard. Harder. Now you're going to put this one in for me because you're good at doing this kind of thing. I'm Here you go. Tiny no, don't make holes or else all our no, mixture no, will. No, no, tiny. I tell you what you can do if you want. You can use the fork to make tiny holes like that. But really, really tiny ones. I'm mixing it. You're mixing the pastry. Look, I've made a big fountain. A big fountain? Somehow I think that's not what's meant to happen. What do you think? Yeah. You think that's what's meant to happen? Yeah. You're mashing it all up? Yeah. Oh dearie dearie me. That, that don't be nice. Do you think so? Yeah. You think it'll be nice because it's like a fountain? Yeah. Oh dear. Should I just carry on and cut up the pastry while you do that? Yeah. Who chopped this one up? Who chopped this one up with their fork? Me. Is it you? This one, we'll call that one the Archie one. More holes? Who made holes in that one? Me. We'll call that one the Archie one as well. Well I've managed to rescue those tarts. I'm going to put them in the oven, bake them blind for about 15 minutes. Uh oh. Try not to make too much of a mess. No, no. What are you doing? I want some tea. No. no. I don't know what to put in. Well Archie's busy making one of his famous soups right next to me now so I'm going to gently heat up my milk, my cream, and I'm going to put in some cinnamon sticks as well. Oh my goodness, we've got a complete disaster here. What? Wow. Okay, this hasn't worked. What? I just don't know if it just hasn't worked. No, not work. You know what? I honestly don't know, oh, darling. Oh, you, you, you burnt it. I think I might have burnt it a little bit. But when since burn is not to it. Mm. Oh, oh dear. Yeah, oh dear. Oh dear is absolutely right. I'll be honest with you, these are the most unappealing pastry tarts I think I've ever made. But I'm going to plough on and hope that we can actually make something of this. We're going to make our custard mix. Can you mix all those eggs together for me? Good whisking and pour the sugar in. Thank you. And mix it all together. Possibly the worst pastry tarts I've ever seen. No, no, no pastry in there. I've had enough of that pastry. I've fallen out of love with that. I don't mix it in. Mix the pastry in. I'm just not sure it's a good idea. But what you can do is can you get the vanilla it's in okay something tells me that this is not going to work today i just have that feeling okay can you pour in we need to pour some of this in sort of a drop i don't know how much a drop okay that's enough can you mix it in for me now Thank what are we going to do next? And then... I'm going to tiny bit to this. Uh, not cumin. Cumin wouldn't be a very good idea. Oops! Cumin wouldn't be a very good idea in our... Tiny bits. No, we've got plenty of that. Oh dear. So I put some toxic. Here we go. Go on then. Gently. There we go. And then in there it goes as well. No! No, no! Got enough vanilla I think in that one. We'll call that one the Archie one. 
Careful, darling. This is the worst pastry I've ever used. And like oh, all like all good chefs, I'm blaming my tools. What, darling? When it's cooked. Here you go. We need to sprinkle this on like that. Okay, but don't whatever you do, don't put it in the custard. So just shake it on from up from high up, from high up like that. Okay, now what do you think the chances are of those turning into tarts? I'd say about zero. What do you think? Zero. Zero. Okay, let's put them in the oven. Out you go. Say good luck, tarts. Good luck, tarts. Yeah, I think they're really gonna need it. I hide it. Are you? Well I always say that these videos are an honest reflection of what really happens in our kitchen and today has been a complete disaster. The pastry didn't work, it's been messy, it's been chaotic, but we also had a lot of fun and that's what matters most. I've got no idea how these custard tarts are going to come out of the oven, so it's time to take them out and see whether we've actually got something we can eat. Well, they're not quite as bad as I feared they were going to be. The custard looks really lovely and springy, and I'm sure that part of the tarts will be delicious. I think the pastry let us down somewhat today, but we're going to eat some before Archie's nap and save the rest for later.